Yo, what is up, guys? It's Top City Gaming, man, and uh, I'm basically playing a pretty much a solo quads game right now because my teammates died and left me. And what I just picked up, man, is the spotter scope, and I don't know if a lot of you guys have used it or not yet, and I just basically kind of want to shove it off, man, to you guys and show you how it works, man. This is the spotter scope right here. It's basically a uh, pair of, like, binoculars that you can use thermal on, you can change the zoom on, and anytime you are using these, it does not show a glint, like, um, like, I, I can see that guy right now, and he cannot see me. I'm sure he might be able to see me if he has a sniper or something like that, but he can't see me if, if, um, You've got gas as if I had a glint on my sniper, you know what I mean? This is the spotter scope, man. I just kind of wanted to show it to you guys. Um, I'm sure a lot of you guys have already seen it and already know what it looks like, but for those of you guys who do not have, or do not know how it works or have not been able to find it in game man this is the spotter scope probably one of the cooler things they have put in um in the uh new season update man and uh i'm just probably just gonna finish this game out if you guys do want to watch this video and watch me finish it i may not I may not even get another kill you know what i mean but that's all you guys checked in for. I appreciate you watching, guys. Damn, I kind of wish this thing. My sniper scope is thermal. Oh boy. You're losing ground. He's straight just mobbed on his teammate. Later, buddy. Now I can pull out the sniper scope again, or the spotter scope again. And this guy, if he didn't see me beforehand, he probably has no idea where I'm at. I may be even able to hit him. Oh, he ran away. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, yeah. He's probably going to run inside this building. Damn it. So I don't really know if I would necessarily trade this in for like a heartbeat sensor depending on what game mode you're playing really. Um, I would say if you're solo and you're by yourself, maybe I would stick to the heartbeat sensor. But if you are in a squad man and you're not really worried about people being around you and you're not knowing, then I think maybe this would be pretty good. Pretty good attachment, man. People all the way over there. I really do enjoy the uh, thermal part of it. Enemy UAV overhead. Gas is inbound. Marking new safe zone. See, like right now, I feel like it would be useful to have a heartbeat sensor instead of the spotter because I got a good feeling he's camping in here, but I don't exactly know where. I 
I can hear him running. Enemy UAV overhead. Enemy UAV overhead. Enemy UAV overhead. I want to say he's definitely in here. I just don't know where at. Only 25 remain. Alright guys, that is the spotter scope, just a little informational video about how that works, man. If you guys did find this helpful or anything like that, man, um, feel free to like and subscribe, yo, and uh, I appreciate you guys watching.